Well, thousands of cows from Tulare County are now on higher ground after flooding has forced several dairy farmers to move them out. Fox 26 reporter Rich Rodriguez explains what the flooding is also doing to the crops dairymen grow to feed their cows. Six days ago, a levee broke on the river five miles upstream from Nick Coots Dairy Farm in Tulare. He thought it was too far away to impact his dairy. Come Thursday, this whole place was underwater. I was worried the cows were all going to drown. So uh, we made the decision to uh, get a bunch of trucks, fr friends, family, we, and we, we, we were able to haul the, all the cows off. Coot says it took two days to move 1,200 cows to his father-in-law's, his cousins, and another place that takes farm animals. Flooding at the Mendonca Dairy in Tulare forced them to evacuate the herd. We had a evacuate about a thousand head that were on the lower part of the dairy so we did that by having a bunch of traders come in and we took some to our neighbors that were up higher ground. Dairymen grow various crops to feed their cows. Right now these two say it doesn't look good. Our crops of wheat right now some of them they might survive uh, the ones that took the blunt of the water where it was basically a river running right through it. If these fields don't yield or they all die, I'm in trouble feeding the cows in the future. So I don't know if I'm going to start this place up or call it quit and then just cut my losses. The Tulare County Farm Bureau is connecting the ag community with information and resources. Many dairies have had their feed damaged. So there is a variety of challenges with um, replacing silage and getting alfalfa you know, onto some of the replacement locations. Moving cows to higher ground has been priority number one for Coot and Mendonca. They say when the storms pass, they'll size up their losses and see how they overcome the flood of 2023. Rich Rodriguez, Fox 26 News. The dairy is king in Tulare County with milk as the top agricultural commodity. The most recent crop and livestock report had it valued at almost $2 billion. It is a big deal there. Tulare County has set up an emergency flood hotline. Here is the number. It's right there on your screen. 559-802-9791.